Now, the desperate search still underway for two swimmers who went missing in the water near Orange Beach more than 24 hours ago. A third swimmer found floating in the water last night in critical condition. Morella Porter joining us live near the place they went missing. Morella, still no sign of those two missing swimmers tonight. No, Michael and crews were searching along the beach and in the water all day. Police say the three were visiting from Louisiana together and they were able to identify them after finding their tent on the beach. The search continues for two men still missing in the water near Perdido Pass. Police say 22 year old Darius Robinson and 28 year old Ryan Guy were last seen hanging on to a float, waving their arms for help around 630 last night. Around the same time, 28 year old Jasmine Brundy was found by boaters floating face down in the water. As rescue crews scour the area, beachgoers are warned to be cautious. This area can change from nice calm water to really rough and a strong current and a blink of an eye. The water today proving too powerful for at least two people who could no longer control their canoe and had to be helped out. Some locals say the unpredictable waters are enough to keep them away from this area. Don't get me wrong, I have swim over here at this beach, but um, I, the current here is really strong and um, it, you know, you just never know. Inexperienced swimmers who come here often say they try to keep a good distance. I like the water. I do know how to swim a little bit, but it still just terrifies me. Don Stokes says he enjoys getting in the water, but knows how dangerous it can be, especially for tourists. I get in the water, but I don't go out too far because I know about the drop offs and all of that. So people who are not familiar with that would walk out there in the water drop off and can't get back in, sometimes because of the currents. Now tonight, the hope is to find these two men alive, but if not, at the least, to bring closure to their family. Police have asked beachgoers and boaters to keep an eye out until they're found. Live in Orange Beach, Morella Porter, Fox 10 News.